Good morning, guys. I want to challenge you to do something today that I think could change the way that your whole day goes. In fact, it could change the whole way this whole season goes if you can make this into a rhythm and a habit in your life. I want you today to challenge yourself to take 10 minutes, that's it, 10 of them, to set your screens down. In fact, I want you to do that right now. Well, not right now, maybe at the end of this video. But at the end of this video, just take 10 minutes. All of Instagram is still gonna be there. All of TikTok is still gonna be there. It's all, all of Disney Plus and Netflix will be there. Like, it's okay. You can set it down for 10 minutes and just ah, be a human for just a second. Uh, the scripture says, be still and know that I am God. Over and over again, we see Jesus uh, getting away from all of the busyness of his day. And he was, he was a really busy guy. He didn't even have screens. He was just busy with all the stuff he had to do. And he would get away, especially in the morning. He would get away to, to pray and to be with his heavenly father. And so I know for some of you, it might feel a little awkward to like pause. Maybe you need, you're like me, you need to set a timer uh, to like actually have that space or a reminder on your phone. Like you can use technology to help you to do this. Uh, but I wanna encourage you, just take a few minutes to pause. And you might have a number of emotions that come up. You might have uh, like a moment where you realize, oh, I actually am a little anxious or, oh, I actually am kind of feeling a little depressed today or oh I haven't really talked with God in a while and the amazing thing is that when we seek God with time like that when we build a rhythm into our life like that we can meet God there in his grace and that grace walks with us all through the day uh, and I, so I'm telling you take a few minutes today set the screen down now that we're finishing this video uh, and take a few minutes to be human and to be with the God who loves you